In this example, uh, we're going to solve um, an exponential equation uh, that arises from an application. So in this problem, we're told that uh, traffic at a certain uh, popular website has increased by 25% uh, a year since 2008. So this is a, a, a great um, opportunity for using an exponential function because exponential functions are used to model uh, this steady percentage increase um, uh, like is described here uh, in this problem. So we're going to let g of t be the number of millions of page views of this website and uh, t years after uh, the year 2008. So we know that number of web views has been growing by 25% uh, each year. So the formula for this function g, uh, as I already uh, described, turns out to be an exponential function. So here's the uh, function formula. g of t is 3 times uh, 1.25 raised to the t power. And what we want to know here is approximately how long uh, will it take it uh, for the number of page views um, to reach 28 million. So since the number of millions of page views is the um, output from this exponential function g, uh, then we can answer this question uh, by solving uh, the following equation. That's the equation that we get by uh, substituting 28 uh, for the um, output uh, in this um, equation. So we have 28 uh, is equal to 3 uh, times 1.25 uh, uh, to the t power. So uh, first I need to do a little bit of simplifying here on this equation. I'm going to divide both sides by 3 uh, to eliminate this uh, coefficient 3 from the right hand side of the equation. And so we get 28 thirds 28 over 3 is uh, 1.25 uh, to the t power. So of course this is an exponential equation since our unknown t uh, that we want to solve for here is contained in uh, the exponent of a power. And um, I'm going to solve this equation by uh, applying uh, a particular log function to both sides of the equation. That's so that I can remove uh, the unknown t from uh, the exponent uh, of this power. So let's um, apply the natural log function. Uh, to both sides of this um, equation, although we could apply uh, the common log function or in fact log uh, uh, with any base uh, in order to solve this um, uh, exponential equation. So I have natural log of 1.25 to the t power uh, is the same as the natural log of 28 um, over 3. Okay, so um, now we can apply the exponent to coefficient property uh, to bring this uh, exponent t down as a coefficient to this uh, natural log function. So I have t times uh, the natural log of 1.25 is the natural log of this quotient 28 over 3. And as you will recall, uh, uh, when you have natural log of a quotient, uh, that's the same as um, the difference of the natural log of the numerator and the denominator of that quotient. So natural log of 28 thirds is the same as natural log of 28 minus uh, the natural log of 3. And now of course I'm going to finish solving this equation for t just by dividing both sides of the equation by the natural log of 1.25. So when I do that I get t is equal to uh, natural log of 28 uh, minus the natural log of 3 um, divided by uh, the natural log of 1.225. So that's the exact value for uh, t. Uh, so that would tell us uh, how many uh, years it's going to take for this number of page views to reach 28 million. Uh, but um, we need it, it would be better if we had a, dex a decimal approximation for this exact solution so that we could uh, give a more meaningful um, solution. Uh, to this problem. So let's estimate the natural log of 28 minus the natural log of 3 divided by uh, the natural log of uh, 1.25. All right, so um, let's first uh, calculate the natural log of 28. And so that's approximately 3.33.
if we round to a couple of des decimal places. Uh, now let's estimate the natural log of 3. So that's approximately 1.0. Nine, uh, or if we round that off, we might round that off to 1.1. So 1.10. And then divided by the natural log of uh, 1.25, which is approximately 0.22. So this is an approximate uh, 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 value uh, for our unknown uh, t, approximate solution for our unknown t, uh, because I've rounded off here to a cu couple of decimal places. All right, so let's continue um, simplifying um, this estimated value for t. And so 3.33 minus 1.10, that's about 2.23, and we're dividing by 0.22. So again, let's estimate that with the calculator. We have 2.23 divided by 0.22, and that's about 10.1, um, ah, approximately. <coughs> so in other words, that tells us that it's going to take about... Um, 10.1 years, a little more than 10 years, right, for um, this number of page views to reach um, 28 million. So there's the answer to the question.